Alright, so this is my new apartment. Is your new digs? It sucks. <laughs> Let's open this. Let's take these blood bags. Are there. Why did you buy the apartment like that? Uh, actually, I don't live here. Uh, well, I do now. Ever since becoming a vampire, they're like, yo, you can't leave town. Uh, and so they got me an apartment, and uh, it sucks, and put some blood bags in there to, like, start me off. And I just accidentally pulled the cabinet door <laughs> off. <laughs> I tried to put it back. You need those. I don't need nothing. This place <laughs> sucks. And I got it myself this a nice place. Lacuna Coil uh, friggin' Lacuna poster. Lacuna Coil? <laughs> oh, this is a pretty good band. I don't think I know that. <laughs> I don't think I've ever heard of them. I think it's, they got a female singer. I don't remember her name, but I remember it was I remember being pretty good. All right, so uh, the password for my new computer, the only good thing in this apartment besides that poster, that sweet Lacuna Coil poster, is That's Sunrise. Sweet. Sunrise is my password. And at my convenience, I need to visit uh, uh, M. Strauss Tremere Regent because... Uh, he senses great power in me. Okay. And the Tremere, as I was saying earlier, are, uh... Email. Are the, uh, the Blood Mages. Sunrise. <laughs> Sunrise. Alright, so, one. Uh. A reminder. <laughs> Bless you. Thank you. That just... Oh, man, that attacked me. <laughs> attacked me like a Sabbat vampire. So, I got a... Uh, LaCroix is the name of the prince. He is such an a-hole. Maybe that's why those drinks are bad. Because he made them. Maybe. Yeah, LaCroix drinks? Yeah, I've never tried I've never, I've never tried it either, but uh, his thrall Mercurio is gonna contact me. Oh, we're in Santa Monica in uh, in like L.A. Yeah, or somewhere. Yeah, I think part two taking place there again. Uh, it, I saw the the trailer and they were like, "This is Seattle." It, I feel like this said Santa Monica. I'd have to watch the trailer again. Alright, anyway, next to, uh, dang, <laughs> it's big, you know, hung yeah, low like at trojanbot.net, penis enlargement, watch the girls come running, call today. What? 1-800-555-STICK. We need to call them, dude, hurry up. There's an extra, there's an extra number there, though. <laughs> what? S T I C K is not four numbers, it's five. <laughs> Alright, and trying to scam us. To the to the neck that ain't a real penis enlargement, not like mine. Not like my it's stuff. If you want like some real I use. If you want some real penis enlargement, you subscribe to Weeton on YouTube and send me a message. And I will I will send you a free trial of Weeton's penis enlargement. What kind they, of penis enlargement? Work. You don't know. Are they pills? Is it a shot? You don't know. It's uh Subscribe to Weeton. <laughs> okay, so Subscribe. some yeah. some dude named Kilpatrick's crime pewter uh from Arthur at Dirt Cheap Internet. Looking for that lazy A ex husband who's late on his alimony payments? How about that jerk who's knocked you up? Look no further. With Arthur Kilpatrick's amazing crime pewter, 
you can find almost anyone with a record. And these days, that's just about everyone. So come on down to Arthur Kilpatrick's Bail Bonds. If you've got the deadbeat, we've got the technology to find him. <laughs> and well, we uh, need to get our deadbeat guy who knocked us up. Oh man, I'm so tired of being knocked up. <laughs> it's like up I'm constant, out here. constantly being knocked up. <laughs> all the uh, consequence on me and no one else. All right, and this is Mercurio saying, "Hey, come visit me at friggin' uh, build w the, the next building over." Mer Mercurio. Mercurio. <laughs> Mercurio is uh, a thrall for Lacroix. Okay, I, I would just I'd say Mercutio or something like that. Mercutio. Uh, might be Italian. Mercutio. <laughs> and a an anonymous one that just says the game begins upon is moved. Huh. All right, we've read Here all of himself. our emails. We've read all of our emails, and guess what? Money envelope. I guess. Bet you didn't see that Money. coming. I got a hundred dollars. Also, bucks. also I can like put stuff in this later. All the penis enlargement pills. Oh yeah, girl. <laughs> Gonna enlarge your penis, girl. I hate that Discord doesn't. I guess count this as a moving video because if our screensaver keeps popping up. That's pretty funny. <laughs> Uh, all right, so this is telling us all about news and stuff, and uh, as we go through the game, it'll be like, yo, this is happening in the world, and it's like a lot of times. It's because of us. <laughs> <laughs> Failed! All right, let's... All right, let's well. blood buff. You don't tell me I failed at my lockpicking. I didn't mean to do that. I'm always trying to click to open the doors and stuff. Yeah. All right, so I come in here, and I'm I'm gonna try to. Tr I didn't trying? mean to do that either. God Are damn. you hitting the stuff? Hey, I got the thing that I came in here for. Peeping a voyeur's field guide. What? <laughs> I picked up peeping a voyeur's field guide. Well, we get a guide becoming a peeping tom. Uh, yeah. And you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna I'm gonna read it. This item is beneath my ability. Ah, oh, you're too dumb to read it. No, it's beneath my ability. I'm too smart to read it. You're oh, too, it's because oh. my it's because my stealth skill is is too high. It wouldn't my stealth skill wouldn't go up because of it. Oh, okay. So are you too like I don't need this garbage. Yeah, I already know I'm how to. Better than I, this. I already know how to peep. <laughs> I'm the best peeping Tom around. Nobody sees me. I'm in your room right now. <laughs> Gruesome remains found in the carnival. Okay. All right. I'm just gonna go in here. I'm home. Uh. Excuse me. Why does? You got you got nothing in your kitchen. I'm really hungry. You can't take your computer then? Alright, fine. <laughs> Man, this entire apartment building sucks. It sucks, yeah. I don't even think there was anything in this one. Oh, and this is my, this is my mailbox. I'll be getting mail later. Alrighty. That, that one is mine. I'm trying Can to steal stuff from my, from my mailbox. Can we upgrade our apartment? Uh, I know as a Tremere you can, but I'm not sure if you can as a Gangrel. So you're, you're kind of vampire, depends on how much you can decorate. Uh, I, I, I hope I can change apartments because this place sucks. It sucks, yeah. Unless you can uh. just get a, a Tremere freaking apartment either way. Yeah, well, I guess we'll find out. All right, here, have a have a uh, have a dollar, have a dollar, bum. Stay there for when I'm hungry. 
<laughs> Stick around, I might need you later. Stay on ice. I like it cool. <laughs> well, that's new. Oh, man. He had his period. It's just like California. <laughs> Dude, California sucks. <laughs> California is a terrible I've, place. I've never lived there. It's dirty. People suck there. I mean, but they they while. have this they have this like sense of morality that they think that they are so much better than you. <laughs> what you doing? Wow. He gave me so much information, and he is looking to the left whenever. <laughs> I don't know if that actually matters in this game. Well, I don't know, yeah. Uh, could I persuade you to help me out? My wallet's been stolen. <laughs> Oh well, uh, y you wanna, you wanna get that penis sucked, bro? I mean, <laughs> and I have a wife too. <laughs> All right, sorry to bother you. He's waiting for a police officer friend of his. I don't know how to interact with this dude. I don't know either. Because it's basically like he's just a random dude on the street that you can actually talk to. And nothing I ever do works out. Now we're here with this weirdo. Just can't win over his heart. I can't. <laughs> I'll suck that penis someday. <laughs> someday. Someday. Oh. I'll right, get what, the suck that I desire. <laughs> what's sad Dan over here all about? Uh, need something, pal. Uh. Too. I'm okay, just looking for something. Say that again. Say that again. Uh, okay, I'm looking for someone. You're a vampire, aren't you? No! What? I'm not a vamp- Who? What's a vampire? What? Vampire? The hell are you smoking? The hell are you smoking, bro? Oh man. Alright, uh, fine, let's talk. Yeah. Oh, Keep it down! Hell yeah! You were, just it's just screaming to the crowd. It's a vampire! It's like, this is the weirdest. This is one of the weirdest games because the whole premise is like, we're under. We're, we're stealthy. We're not letting humans know that vampires exist. Yet everywhere you go in this game, you are talking to people that's like, "Oh, vampires, right?" <laughs> uh, you know, you are pretty gray skinned. Yeah, but my dreads—they hide the fact that I'm a vampire. <laughs> vampires don't have dreads. Yeah, I mean, you have dreads, so that's. Oh, they're called not ghouls, real. not thralls. <laughs> So, how would you assume uh, people are made into vampires? If the how? bite doesn't change, how would you assume? I'd say maybe an exchange of blood, maybe. In All right. Other cases, it's All like right. you drink some of their blood or something. Yeah, you'd think, right? Well, guess what? You said you're a ghoul, right? What's that? A ghoul. Is a Renfield because they are given vampire blood. Okay. They, they're just given vampire blood every now and then, and uh, they get a little bit of vampire power, but they're still human. So I guess exchanging blood doesn't work. Then what? What? What do they do? I have no clue. 
how it's vampires are made in this game. Not that I can remember, anyway. Yeah, the any other thing that I've seen, it's the blood is what'll change. And that f that fucking true blood, you, vampire blood, is like a drug. Yeah, uh, w we were talking about that the other day, actually, weren't we? Yeah, we were. Yeah. Like it gives you an infiniboner. Yeah, there's a dude who literally just had the a huge boner for the longest time. Like, who are you supposed to call from a vampire blood-induced boner that lasts longer than four hours? <laughs> uh, I think uh, in the world where they know vampires, I think that hospitals know how to deal with it in that <laughs> in that place. But he just was afraid to tell somebody he took vampire blood for his boner. <laughs> Okay, so this guy's on a secret mission. Secret mission. He's on a secret mission. I'm gonna just say see you around, so I'm not calling him an idiot. Yeah. Okay, so here's a prostitute. Hey, need a date? Okay. We can pay her like fifty bucks, I think, hey, to baby. to follow me to a, a secluded area so I can get some sip. Uh, good luck finding a bidet around here. Nice, that guy I talked to <laughs> just said that whenever I walked by him. All right, let's follow this guy who's uh. Let's see. Oh. Let's see what's going on with him, man. Oh, oh, is that right? Oh, oh, <laughs> oh! I could clean that for you if you want. I got my tongue is really, really. It's like scrubbing bubbles, man. <laughs> My tongue works so you don't have to. <laughs> All right. Uh All right, what happened to this dude? They ripped him off and he's dying. Are you Mercurio? Yeah. You looking for the astrolite? I uh, I wasn't looking for astrolite, but I guess you could point me in the direction. <laughs> And apparently his eyes popped, so that's real gross. Yeah. All right. Uh, stay with me. What happened? Stay alive. My rib? Oh, shit. My rib is poking through my side? I'm all numb. You gotta look and tell me. Okay. So he's... He thinks that there's the lump in his side is his rib poking out. Oh, he can pop that back in. Uh, it's not his rib though. I it could be like it's a broken bottle. <laughs> now tell me what happened. Or yep, it's a rib. <laughs> I'm gonna be like it's a broken bottle. Okay, so I, I need to get that astro light right. Or these guys, they come out of nowhere. Yeah, But we gotta worry about junky pricks. Yeah, that was an amateur move. You went alone. You're dumb. <laughs> I know you pretty much asked for this. <laughs> yeah. So this is Maurizio. Uh... And Bloody the vampire soul. blood is the only thing keeping him together. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna go get it. Well, let's go get it. I'm gonna go get that astrolite. Dennis got my money through that brick. Okay. All right, he gave me directions. That's not going to help me. Oh, that's always helpful. Not, not to me. <laughs> All right, I'll... Uh, is there anything I can help you? I'll, I'll bring you back some uh, estrogen.
have the deal. I mean it. You tell anyone about this, I'm dead. I'm begging you. I got a way of getting people what they need. You don't say anything, I can help you out. Yeah, don't worry, man. Good to know. Goodbye. Don't no. I have some freaking... I picked up a pill bottle. What was it? Estrogen. You got some estrogen. I made up the estrogen joke. <laughs> well, I was not go. expecting estrogen. <laughs> Do I need to keep the estrogen? Yeah. Let's take it later. It says not for male use. Maybe it's like a, a special female only healing item or something. Uh, I mean, maybe. I mean, estrogen does suture wounds, right? It increases the, the female healing factor. Is that right? I don't know, I don't know either. I hey, look, look. Say nothing of that. Let's go to the pawn shop real quick. Mm -hmm. 